Hello and welcome, this is Blockchain Bloom, the Blockchain Educator, and of course today we're going to discuss the big dump what just happened, you know, in a couple of minutes, basically, in Bitcoin, and we're going to talk about also the possibility how it can happen that Bitcoin will be $10 million dollar. Uh, per Bitcoin. According to Hal Finney, this is definitely a possibility which Bitcoin can reach. So all this in today's video. And if you haven't subscribed to this channel, then please do so because I deliver you the freshest news in Bitcoin and blockchain every day from Monday to Friday. You should press the subscribe button down there and also the bell so you get the notification and don't miss a video. I uploading the videos in lunchtime, Central European time. So you have this every day from Monday to Friday. And uh, let's real quick check the market, how it looks like right now. So Bitcoin, we have 9,527% uh, uh, right now, minus 5% uh, dump in the last 24 hours. And when we're looking at the winners, we still have winners. Uh, Flexicoin, for example, 8% plus plus. Uh, uh, Neem or NEM, it's a plus six percent, and uh, Chile's it's also uh, plus five percent. And when we're looking at the losers, well, Nexo we have minus twenty-two percent, uh, Made Safe Coin minus ten percent, and Maker is minus seven percent uh, in the last twenty-four hours. And then let's look at what really happened now. You know. Uh, here uh, we can see this article and uh, it discusses it that in five minutes, literally less than five minutes, Bitcoin price dropped 8%. And uh, this is actually, you know, crazy. Uh, of course, behind it uh, must be uh, something. So it's not just happening uh, like this. Uh, probably a couple of Bitcoin holders did that together. And uh, when it increased uh, very significantly a day before from 9,500 up to 10,200 and something, it was also very similar. And what we can uh, we see here, uh, we call it uh, the, the BART pattern. And why it is, I can show it here. Look. <laughs> That's why. And this is happening in cryptocurrency uh, quite often. You know, there are some whales, some big ones, uh, they pump uh, money in, therefore the price go up, it stays a little bit up there, and then when they're selling, the price just drops. But actually nothing significant happened. Two days ago, we were just here, where we are right now, around 9,500. So... Those who did something in short term and they forgot to sell and they are really interested just in short term, they are in trouble. But, you know, the hodlers, I think they're still uh, doing uh, very well. I have here a very good uh, picture. Check this one out. And this was uh, made uh, yesterday. So it shows the Bitcoin price is always what was on the 2nd of June. And uh, look, back in 2012, Bitcoin was $5. A year later, it became, became $122. And then uh, in 2014, $652 on the same day. A year later, now we can see here a drop, uh, $222. Then it went up again. Uh, it's like more than double, you know, in one year, uh, $538. And check this out. In 2017, uh, $2,405 on the 2nd of June. And we do know that in 2017, it was this massive rally. And uh, at the end of the year, um, around December, end of December, it reached uh, the peak, which was around $20,000. But even it dropped significantly after that and very quick, you know, in the summertime, 2018, again, 2nd of June, it was 7549 So even after this drop, it's an increase. One year later, when we're looking at it in 2019, same day again, uh, $8,575. And yesterday, 
before this uh, drop, which just ha happened, but it was about you know eight percent minus something like that. Uh, it was ten thousand and one hundred and fifty-five. So this chart perfectly shows that if you're hodling Bitcoin and you're thinking about the long term, then if you started here, 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 wherever you do uh, start or did start, you uh, gained and uh, you made a profit. And uh, this is the prediction actually for the future as well. So I definitely wanted to show you this one. And it has this, yes, uh, the BART pattern, what just happened uh, yesterday. And uh, here uh, I have an article uh, from Cointelegraph uh, and it's where Adam Back actually said that Bitcoin could be easily in five years $300,000. Uh, you know, this guy and also Hal Finney believes that Bitcoin can be actually uh, in a you know, couple of years even $10 million. And how is that possible? And what this article discuss is that, you know, we have this crazy money printing, which can lead to an inflation. And it could happen that in many years or a couple of years, one dollar, which is right now one dollar, it becomes 10 cent. So because of the inflation. Therefore, if we believe that the Bitcoin can make it to $1 million, with this inflation, the $1 million Bitcoin, because of the uh, dollar inflated, can go to $10 million. So if $1, which is now $1, the value of it will be $0.10 cent in a couple of years, then the $1 million Bitcoin will be $10 million. So this is what they discussed, the possibility, how it's possible for Bitcoin to go to $10 million. Basically, thanks for the to the uh, hyperinflation, and yeah, here was another article from the past when actually uh, Adam Back said, and also here Hal Finney, that this could be a possibility, and uh, that's what I wanted to say uh, basically about uh, the Bitcoin increase in long term and how is it possible to a Bitcoin gets uh, 10 million even in a couple of years. Of course, we don't know the future, but if things going in this direction, this crazy money printing and sooner or later the hyperinflation or yeah, inflation at least, then uh, this can actually happen. And when we're talking about uh, this economic situation, it's... Uh, it's, you know, the, the problem starting. Here we have Wells Fargo and it stops giving loans to most independent car dealerships because the car dealer business is just not working. You know, right now, not too many people are buying cars, uh, new cars. Uh, it's pointless. They, they do their savings. They spend their most money on food and other necessary goods for their everyday life. And car, in this case, especially, you know, expensive cars uh, are kind of luxury. And uh, it's a first sign which can lead to, uh, you know, a tragedy in a way that uh, if these businesses don't get loans, they cannot support themselves, they cannot uh, stay alive. And it can uh, lead to the direction that many businesses will fail in the future. And um, this is just now the car uh, industry. But, you know, we can look at other industries as well will affect them and it's coming. Uh, so it's not yet, but it's be going in this direction if this kind of crazy money printing uh, continues. So be aware of it. That's what that's it actually what I wanted to say in uh, today's video. And if you want to receive the freshest uh, blockchain and cryptocurrency news every day from Monday to Friday, then definitely subscribe to this channel. Uh, you know, click the button on YouTube down there. And also click the bell so you get the notification. I'm putting on the videos on YouTube every day from Monday to Friday in lunchtime. So you can accept it, expect it. And uh, yeah, so I'm coming back tomorrow as well. I wish you a great day. And let's see what Bitcoin is doing in the next 24 hours. We're going to talk about tomorrow, uh, definitely. So have a nice day. Bye, guys.